Yo, what is up, guys? Welcome back to more Oxygen Not Included. Things are still going all right, I think. We're looking pretty good on food. We're looking pretty good on Oxygen. Our base is looking slightly less bad. Uh, there's still kind of a lot of water for wear, and now we're getting, getting our dirty, poopy pee water mixed up with that. So that's kind of gross. I think I want to dig this deeper, maybe. I'm not sure. That's probably not a priority. I think the next thing I want to do is build a dining room and then maybe make our garden a little fancier get some lights in there and maybe change up our food supply so people aren't so bummed out about eating lice <laughs> that seems like a pretty good use of time the other thing uh, i noticed or not noticed but somebody mentioned in the comments is that i should get another bed and thank you for all the tips in the comments like being able to build straight lines uh, because that's been <laughs> really annoying so far, not knowing how to do that. Anyways, I think, yeah, just one more bed and we should be good here. And then I, I want to kind of keep, <clears throat> excuse me, you know, they, they are going to sleep, use the bathrooms, eat every day. I want to kind of keep all that stuff centralized, kind of close together. I guess it doesn't have to be near the printing pod, but it will be. <clears throat> because that's where we started. N not really any other good reason for that. <laughs> so, yeah, I think uh, dining room would be a next good thing to, to try to build. And I kind of, you know, I just want to dig all of this crap out and then just build tiles and ladders and stuff. I don't, I think, I've been building my base, like, around dirt, instead of just building through it. And, like, I, now I've got this weird shape right here. I don't know, I'm probably not going to be fixing that. Uh, I think we need another ladder coming over here so they can reach that stuff. Look at that, nice straight line. That felt good. I like that. Right, and then this here, like, this is stupid. Is <laughs> it going to build a little ladder here or something? I don't think they can jump up. I think they can jump up one dial. So, yeah. The shape of my base is a little stupid. But it probably could be worse. It probably could be a lot worse. Uh, I think that also we probably need to get this algae. I, I think that there's probably a way to see all of the resources we have on hand. No. Maybe, I'm not sure. It seems like, oh, is it this? Consumable ore? No. Uh, organic? No. Yeah, organic maybe? Algae. 10 tons. 10 tons. How much is that? Is a ton 2,000 pounds or 2,000 kilograms? Or 1,000 kilograms? I'm not sure. I feel like I should know that. Okay, um, so... Oh, wait. Oh, do we, we researched stuff. This is good. I was waiting on this because now we've got dirty air rising up from our bathroom exhaust. Um... I don't know how to build these, really. Like, do I just stick them anywhere? Use a sand, filter, polluted oxygen from the air. Yeah, reducing spread of disease. Looks like we've got plenty of materials to use to build it. Is that all the information on this thing? I just build them where dirty air is and they'll just do their thing? I don't know how many we need. I bet after you build one, it... Oh, wait. Effects. 90 grams per second oxygen. No requirements. 100 grams per second. So it makes oxygen and clay? Okay. 100 grams per second. How, can we see how much... Dirty oxygen this water's putting off? 
Not clear. Doesn't look like it. I can't even see the polluted oxygen. I think because there's so much carbon dioxide. I'm not sure. But I, I feel like probably a few of these. I don't think they're going to like over clean the air. And if we build too many, then it probably just means that they're going to just split the work evenly. Hopefully. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm totally guessing here. I'm just making shit up. Invalid building location. Do they have to be on tile? I bet. Does it matter? Should I do an airflow tile? Blocks liquid flow without obstructing gas. No? Does not obstruct liquid or gas flow. I think that's what we want. Oops. Not there. Ah, oh, shoot. Yeah? Is that still invalid? Why is that invalid? Where does this thing have to be built? Is it... Is it because the tile doesn't exist yet? That's probably why. Probably once they build the tile, then they can build the thing on it. I wonder if it's dumb to have it right underneath the vent. I'm not sure. I think I'm just gonna let it go and see what happens. Let's set the stuff to, I don't know, seven. What's all this nine? Does that have to carry this stuff away? It probably doesn't need to be a nine. As much as it bothers me to have all this crap down here. Also, maybe build a storage box or a bin close by so they're not making runs super far away. Maybe another one up here because we've got all kinds. Oh, wait, there's, there's already one there. Let's build another one because there's so much stuff. All right. Oh, man, we're going to have lights. I set this work up a long time ago and just never... They never got around to doing it for whatever reason. Either it was inaccessible or who knows. I feel like we just need like a cleaning day to just go and pick all this stuff up. Is this stuff not... What happened to the seeds that were in here? Did the light kill the mealwood? Do they not like light? I'm not sure. There were definitely seeds in there, I think. I definitely think that there were seeds in there. Well, let's see, I guess, when this light... When this light kind of turns on, will these die? I don't know. That seems odd. No, they seem fine. <laughs> we have to do Maybe they got trapped by falling rocks. I'm not sure. I don't know why those don't have seeds in them. Maybe do the seeds have a limited number of, like, cycles that they'll grow the plant? No idea. Let's put a ladder here and make sure that they can get up there. I think that they can only jump up one tile, but I'm not sure. I can't remember. I don't know where to find that information. Yeah, you know, I feel like we just need to dig, like, a lot of this stuff out. Whoa, ew, what is this? Polluted oxygen? Slime lung? Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, that seems bad. Has anyone breathed that yet? <laughs> I don't see any slime lung anywhere. I also don't know how bad slime lung is. Is that like you just kind of have a bad day? Or is that like you get sick and die? It probably depends on if you have medicine, which I don't. <laughs> Maybe I should be building a little hospital for these guys. Is that a room, I wonder? Probably, like a clinic? Hospital, yeah. I should build a hospital. I don't know where I would build that. Like maybe here? Split off the research and power room and build a tiny hospital? That seems stupid. I wonder, is it deodorizer deodorizers? Will that fix? Uses water to filter carbon dioxide from there. Takes in water, carbon dioxide power. Makes polluted water and heat. Okay. Well, that'll be good to keep in mind for when we get overrun with carbon dioxide, which, you know, could be pretty soon. Oh, what the hell is that cute thing? A pipsqueak? 
Oh, that's adorable. Where did that come from? <laughs> I don't think we can interact with the animals right now. Okay, I'm getting super sidetracked. Hold on. Slime lung. Carbon skimmer. Cool. Glad to know that that exists. Um, deodorizer. It just says polluted oxygen. Well, this says polluted oxygen. Slime lung. I think this is like a yellow alert situation. Maybe it's not, but it, it certainly feels that way. And... I don't have any tiles to build it on. I could build like a couple here for now. I think the material is not an issue. Do these require power? They don't even require power? Are you serious? Okay. I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm just surprised. And then maybe build like a couple tiles a little higher. That stuff's yellow alert, right? Build a couple tiles, not yellow alert, but like pretty high a little bit higher and then maybe a couple more of these at yellow alert probably I have no idea let's just try that I just don't want these guys to die of slime lung that sounds like a terrible way to go oh yeah look he's complaining he's like hey this air is disgusting Okay. Awaiting delivery. So... Nine? Like, let's get on that, guys. We gotta protect Pipsqueak here, too. I assume she would not enjoy... a breath full of slime lung. Okay. So now, how is this looking? Uh, there's something going on here. The slime lung is confused. I can't tell what's happening. Is it working? Did I save us? I'm not sure. I guess we just have to wait and see. I mean, these are clearly working while these are not. That's okay though. I feel like having a couple extra is probably a good thing. Oh yeah, it, it, it is working its way down here. You know, Frankie's standing in it and it does, he's crawling all through it. And he doesn't seem too bothered. I'm not sure... I don't understand how slime lung works. It seems like you maybe would breathe it in and then die. <laughs> Apparently it's not quite that bad. Can I... Frankie, you're so fast, I can't, can't even click on you. Uh, germs. He's got some resistance. I don't know, it doesn't like... I don't see anything. I don't see anything about it. He had mild exposure to slime lung. Let me slow down the game a little bit. It's going a little fast right now. While I'm figuring out this health crisis. Rate of contracting, 3%. Exposed breathing to infill polluted oxygen. Huh. Apparently it's just not that bad and I'm overreacting. But that's fine. I would rather that I slightly overreact to something like this than underreact to it. I mean, these things aren't even like... They don't look like they're working anymore. There's just not, not enough germs for it to matter, I guess? It's a very mild amount of germs. I guess 2,000 germs is a pretty low amount, you know, considering that they're germs. That's, I mean, that's 99% of them are dead, right? That's your 99%. <laughs> I mean, like how many? Yeah, like there's a million in there. Okay. I think we're okay. Now, so what is... What do we do with a chunk of slime, I wonder? I bet that's used for stuff. Um, Alright, let me, let me back up here and stop worrying about that. And... Rowan had his cuisine attribute raised. Long commutes, that's... 
not even close to something that I can start thinking about and solving. No research selected. Now that is something I can take care of. If we want to do more research. I don't know if we need to research right now. I'm already so overwhelmed by the few things that we have. I don't know that I need any more research at the moment. Yeah, I don't think so. I just haven't messed around with this. Haven't used this yet. Don't even know what that is. I... We're still battling the tiny amount of slime lung in the air. I don't think I need pathogen diagnostics. Haven't even built a sick bay. Uh, air systems? Yeah, probably not. Filtration, gas filter, liquid filter. Refines, oh, look at that. Refined slime into algae. Oh, that's awesome. We should do that. I, I don't know how actually how much of a priority that is. I just see that it's something that I feel I would be able to use. What does this other stuff do? Lumber into ethanol. I was not even aware that there was wood. Water sieve. Clean water from polluted water using sand. Okay, so I'm liking both of these. I feel like I could put both of these to good use fairly quickly, but let's maybe just check out a little bit more. We've already got decontamination. Mechanized airlock. Yeah, that's awesome and not something that I'm even remotely close to being able to utilize. Temperature modulation. Okay, so here's a thing that I've noticed. That seems bad. Our base is, I guess, a fine temperature right now. It's temperate. It looks fine. Um, I noticed that all around us is warm. <laughs> so <clears throat> that seems bad. You know, because once our base starts warming up, we're not going to have any place close by to cool things down. That I don't know what that is. That looks very strange. A brain in a jar and a chair with clearly some kind of neural vacillator thing. I I don't know. That is cool. I want to go over there and explore that, but this looks dangerous. Uh, yeah, so I don't know what's going on with the temperature here. It's warm all around us. That seems bad. Maybe it's not. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. I can't even start to worry about that right now. Uh, so temperature modulation, maybe? Converts water into ice. We can start making cold. That's probably what we're going to need to do before too long. Insulated tile. That seems like it'd probably be pretty good. Um, our, I haven't done anything with decor. Like, almost nothing. And also, I feel like that's super low priority. Computers. Yeah, I, I enjoy a good computer. But... I think we've got a lot of other stuff to worry about. So distillation, I think this is probably not a bad thing to get. I don't know if we need it right this second. Maybe Rowan could be using his time more effectively somewhere else. Well, right now he's cooking, and I don't think that's what I want at all. Who's our cooking person? Nobody? I thought I assigned a cooking person. Who, who cooks? Somebody cooks. I guess I did give him that, but I think that was a mistake. I think, I thought Harold, no. Catalina, no. Ruby. Ruby is the one with nine cuisine. Rowan has three, that's, yeah. Rowan, uh, nobody should even be thinking about cooking. Except for, uh, Ruby. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> Scroll. Scrolling is a thing. Frankie, will you knock that off? Dang it, guys. Just get away from the micro musher. Nobody needs to cook except Ruby. I think she's got this under control. I should also probably build a, a grill. I don't know if we can grill lice. And I don't know if that would make them more palatable. 
mush fry, omelet, gristleberry. I'm not, yeah. I don't know that we can put a grill to great use right now. We need more seeds. Oh, look at that. We did get some more seeds. Let me slow things down a bit here. I'm playing the game a little bit faster than I probably should. Yeah, now that we have light, we could probably grow a lot better stuff. I don't... Com yeah, CO2 to oxygen. I don't feel like we really need that in our food garden. Or, I don't know, like, how's... Well, you know, um, maybe we do. <laughs> do these all use... They don't actually use air. They just have to be in a, the right atmosphere, but they don't actually use the air. Okay. Let's plant maybe an oxy fern. It seems like it could help us out. It doesn't look like it actually needs light. So maybe putting it there isn't the smartest thing. Maybe we put it over here. Let's uproot this since he's harvesting it right now. Or she. I thought that was Harold, but it's Ruby. Okay, let's speed up a little bit. Yeah, let's, no, uproot that. Okay, I guess I'll just wait for somebody to do that. Probably Harold will do it here any minute. Um, I'm gonna keep digging all that stuff out. I guess I need to build ladders, huh? Oh, wait, wait, no, no, no. <laughs> That's not what I meant. Um, oh, priority, there we go. It, sorry about that. False alarm, guys. False alarm. <laughs> How is this looking over here? Still a lot of slime long, but I guess it's fine. Oh man, where are these things coming from? Also, what do they do? It's not a squeak anymore, it's just a pip. Pesky, non-hostile critters that subsist on branches of arbor trees. They're known to bury seeds in the ground. Can wrangle them. They came from pip egg, which I think is something that I had as a reward. Speaking of which... More pip eggs. I don't... I don't know that we really want a bunch of pips running around. And I don't think we want... another, um... dupe at this point. None of these guys are really standing out to me as amazing. Yeah, I think we just re reject all. That's fine. Uh, oh, you know what we need? Another way to empty polluted water. Where do I want to do that at? Can I, I probably just need like a separate platform here. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm assuming that I, yeah, I can't build it like over a door. I assume it can't be floating. I wonder how bad it is that it's going to be pouring down the ladder. Is it going to make the ladder gross? I would think so. I think also we can probably go and dig this a little deeper. Man, that shift is nice. <laughs> Being able to hold shift and dig straight lines or build straight lines. That is pretty helpful. Yeah, I guess I could build like another ceiling here instead of having to build ladder like a grid of ladders Also, don't know how high room should be Four tiles high seems pretty high I guess we'll just do that. I don't know It's probably fine I guess the worst thing of having it too high is that it's just roomy. Like, oh no, it's very roomy in here. As opposed to if it's too small. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. 
It seems like a lot worse to have it too small and not have room to build stuff. Yeah, sorry guys. Having to work down there in the very unbreathable air. I wonder... The carbon dioxide situation seems like it's gonna get dire here pretty quick. Do I just need to like dig down and trap it further down or is that you know just gonna buy me a little bit more time and I should build one of those uh, carbon skimmer things? I'm not sure. I feel like digging is probably an easier solution right now since we're gonna have to dig anyway. Like we're eventually gonna wanna dig down here. Am I digging into slime lung? Probably. Yeah, I sure am. That's fine. I mean, we've got a, a line of deodorizers here leading into our base. I'm gonna assume that this is fine, that they can dig down here into the slime lung and they won't die immediately. And then, man, there's a lot of stuff down here too. Like, we should probably dig all of this out. This is all gonna become base, I think. Didn't I say I was gonna build a dining room, like, I don't know, at the beginning of this video, like 20, 30 minutes ago? <laughs> Maybe let's do that real quick before I get distracted yet again. One duplicate and a place to eat. I think they each get one. I don't know how much space we need between them. I think I might just do one for now. Look at that. I'm also... I don't know if I want to build the door right next to the, like, the tunnel here. Seems like I could maybe do myself a favor leaving a space there. I think I'm gonna do that. And then... I don't know how much bigger the dining room has to be. Do I need anything else in the dining room? Probably not. Oh wait, hold on, let's check, uh... This thing, mess hall. Mess table, no industrial machinery. And it's got minimum, maximum sizes. A great hall. Okay. Well, we could maybe try for a great hall. Maximum size, 120. Recreational building. I don't know what that is. Let me slow down the game here while I'm screwing around and thinking about things. I don't know what a recreational building is. Right, is that what that said? Recreational building. What does that mean? I have no idea. Recreation room? Is that just something I have to designate? A decor item? I have no idea. But let's maybe make the dining room a little on the bigger side. Is there an easy way to calculate number of tiles? Can I just... Uh, what is that, 45? I think it was 32 is the minimum size, so I think we're pretty good here on the size. I'll make it just a little bit bigger for like some decor or something. Um, where's the, uh, yeah, I guess furniture is where decor stuff is. Reese's decor, control to morale, must be hung from a ceiling. Corner molding. Beautiful. Oh, look at the decor overlay. I don't think I've looked at this yet. Oh, man, my base is ugly as hell. That's fine, though. Do we, like, do crown molding all across? Look how fancy that is! Oh my goodness! Oh, and a flower pot? That would be beautiful. Maybe, um... How about, a, like, a light or two? I guess we should cancel a couple of these crown moldings. Um, where was that at? Yeah, here we go. Ceiling light. Boom. Boom. We'll have some light in there. This is gonna be great. We should probably get uh, this debris out of here. I'm really, really annoyed by all the debris everywhere. <laughs> I don't know if that's normal or if I've done something terribly wrong. 
We can take that stuff. Take that stuff. Okay. I don't know what I'm gonna build over here. Maybe the kitchen? Maybe like a kitchen up here instead of just like hanging on the edge over here. I, yeah, I wish I hadn't have built this quite so stupid, but I don't know. It's like a weird, like I can't, I guess if I moved it up a tile, I could have a, a couple short rooms. I'm not sure. Probably not a big deal right now, unless I want to build the kitchen like right here, which is probably not a bad idea. And I could build a ladder going up. Uh, I don't know. It's kitchen's definitely gonna be over here somewhere, but I don't even think we need one right now because we don't have things to cook. And a bit of refrigerator. Yeah. Should probably get a refrigerator going. All right, so I'm gonna try to keep these videos a little bit shorter than I have been. I, I feel like I've been going kind of long on these, like 40, 50 minutes. Uh, I wanna make sure that, you know, I'm not going too long, but also getting a reasonable amount of stuff done per episode. That's why I've been trying to keep it on slightly faster speed. So hopefully these are, the pacing on these feels all right. They're not like too fast, too slow, too drawn out. Uh, I feel like I'm making steady progress here with each video. It doesn't seem like much, but I, I feel like this is a pretty long game. Uh, this stuff happens kind of slowly. I mean, if I was better at the game, it'd probably happen a lot quicker, but for my first time, I, I feel like it's moving at a reasonable pace. We're kind of doing one, one project per video. It seems reasonable. Uh, if you guys feel differently, let me know, and I can change it the way I can do them longer, shorter, faster, whatever. Just let me know down in the comments. I appreciate it. Thank you all for watching. Thanks for joining. I will see you in the next video.